Welcome to clickmyproject.com This project will lead us to coordinator for scaling elastic applications across multiple clouds. Let us see the abstract of our process. We presented the architecture, design and evaluation of the cloud coordinator element from the inter-cloud architecture. Coordinator is responsible for publishing offers and requests for resources discovering potential providers of resources and negotiating resources when it is necessary. A cloud coordinator is introduced to handle the last demand for an elastic application in a given time. The cloud coordinator carries out tasks of clients. Its backend contains a virtual machine management integration layer that allows utilization of available virtual machine management technologies. In this paper, we focus on the architecture and design of the cloud coordinator. Let us see the flow of our process. In this process, user requests for resources to any data center. Here we are having two data centers. After sending the request, the coordinator will check the user's request. If the request is possible, then it will provide the request of resources. Otherwise, it will submit the requested resource to the Cloud Exchange. The Cloud Exchange will log the reserved resources temporarily and provide accessibility when the current time is equal to the start time given by the reserved customer. The Cloud Exchange will publish the requested request and offers that are received from various cloud data centers. The coordinators will choose appropriate offers or requests and start negotiation. The cloud exchange will provide the alternative resources if it is not available in the coordinator. The providers having the spare resources will submit their offers to the cloud exchange. It will maintain all the details of the sources. The customer who wants to reserve the resources for a particular time will send the request to cloud. I mean to the cloud exchange. The cloud exchange will check, will reserve those resources and store into the database. If any user requests for that particular reserved resource, it won't provide that resource and instead of the reserved resource, it will provide the alternative resource. Let us execute the process. Open all three packages in NetBeans MultiCloud 1, MultiCloud 2, and MultiCloud 3. First, initial resource utilization is computed. In MultiCloud 1, calculate the resource utility in Cloud Resource 1. We are having four resources, so I have to calculate the resource utilization for all four resources. Get resource, this is physical free memory and CPU usage, click send. This is resource 3 in first data center, click get resource, click send. This is coordinator 1, click receive. This coordinator will receive all the resource details. Here we are having two resources and those details, click send. This is resource 2 in second data center, click get resource, click send. This is resource 4, click get resource, click send. This is coordinator 2, click receive, click send. This is exchange unit, here all resources, details are received here. Click show availability, the availability of all four resources and the details, click on graph. This is the initial utilization of resources for four VMs. Resource 1, 2, 3 and 4, all four resources should be ready to receive any request, so click ready. This is resource 3. We should repeat this for all four resources. Here, client 1 will be selecting a resource out of 4. I am selecting 3. We select it to be ready to receive the request. So, click OK. Pick any process. I mean, any text file. This is client 2. Select the resource 3. 
so it is already selected currently not available alternate resource will be provided click ok so you have to type one two one two or three to get alternate resource like one any one number click ok so resource one is provided for location click ok pick some process resource one and three should be ready to receive the process so click on receive for the resources one and three this is resource three click receive client one click allot button the file will be allotted in resource three here in resource three the file is received in client two click allot button the file will be received in resource one in resource one the file is received here let us see advanced reservation so here the current date and current time will be automatically displayed and your reservation id is displayed here you have to select the resource to be the resource that you need select any resource if it is resource 4 and just copy it so and type the number of hours you need click on receive all four resources should be ready to receive the request so we need to run the advanced allocation for all four resources and click receive it should be repeated for all four resources this is the client form click the reserved process so it is a reserved so we need to select some other resource other clients can't use this reserved resource click ok and here select some other resource resource 2 is ready for the location click ok pick any process click lot and resource 2 the process is received again we need to compute the all resources so we need to process the initial process again so we are going to rank the resources based on the resource utility computation click on receive cloud utility the four resource computations are displayed here and the resources are ranked here click on evaluate here the final resource utilization is displayed here as we are executing the single system we can't uh, see the difference uh, so uh, there will be a minute difference so if we execute in four different systems we can see the difference and here we show the efficient resource utilization and advanced reservation and finally we rank the resources thanks for watching